from A Fish Called Wanda. A pretentious yet crass American Jewel thief who thinks he's smarter than he is. Don't, uh, <laughs> ever, ever, ever call me stupid. Constantly lies and double crosses his teammates and has a very, very, very short temper. You pompous, stuck up, snot nosed, English giant twerp scumbag fuckface dickhead asshole and that short temper leads to both some of the film's biggest laughs and some of its deadliest stakes he may not be the most powerful villain he's primarily played for laughs and he's never actually in control wanda is playing him from the very start but he still poses a legitimate threat to archie leech's happiness and well-being dangling archie out of a window is a great sight gag but it also reminds us of the risks here if Otto is set off the wrong way archie could die this movie isn't afraid to kill old ladies or puppies, so it could totally kill John Cleese. His threats are mostly comical, and he's disposed of comically, but he's still the primary source of any actual danger the movie has. And he's so entertaining that Kevin Kline won a well-deserved Oscar for the role. That's right, an Oscar went to a comedic performance in a film that's more fun than self-important. Maybe Otto really is a master manipulator. What was the middle thing? 